He loves it. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction and why? Uh, one point um, I'm going to give to Claire and I'm doing that because I think she's flying under the radar. Um, during the week she doesn't talk to me much, doesn't approach me even though I try and approach her, doesn't have much to say to me. And then on Sundays and Mondays it's, um, she's as nice as pie and like really nice pie. So what are you saying about her? Oh, perhaps she's insincere but I'm going to say it's under the radar. I think she's avoiding nomination. How? By... You need to explain your nomination. Okay. Um, I think that she is being nice to me to avoid uh, me coming in here and giving her a point. That is all. Thank you. Uh, Camilla, to... to the diary room. Oh, go, Camilla. Go, go, Camilla. Go, Camilla. <laughs> I will. <laughs> Camilla, who do you nominate for two points for eviction and why? Um, Big Brother, I'd like to nominate Galen for two points this week. We've had a couple of run-ins over the last couple of weeks. With regards to the general workings of the house, I find him bossy and a little bit irritating. But when it comes to more contentious issues, he doesn't seem to want to get involved and it makes me sort of feel like he's flying under the radar. Um, and obviously that affects my time in the house because I feel that I'm sort of living with someone who's not necessarily being themselves. Camilla, what are you nominating him for, for flying under the radar or for being bossy? Um, well, with regards to small issues, I think he does come out and he's bossy and irritating towards me with regards to the running of the house. Um, but when it comes to bigger issues, more contentious issues, he doesn't seem to want to get involved and I think that's because he's flying under the radar. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction and why? Um, I'm going to have to nominate Ashley for one point. Um, yet again, this last week I've tried to get to know Ash on more than one occasion especially when we were doing our task I find him really cold towards me he doesn't want to speak to me and frankly I get the vibe that he, he just doesn't want to make the effort so in terms of the people that I would want to live with they're the, the people that who you know want to take time with me and um, want to get to know me and he doesn't seem to want to do that that is all thank you OK, now Camilla and Ashley nominate each other every single week. They Do don't they? like each other. Yeah, every single yeah. week. <laughs> now, what about you and Camilla? Because Camilla actually nominated you last week. And rather than saying, oh, you're messy, I mean, she went on about too big for your boots and blah, blah. It was... But then yeah, by the end like of the that. week, you were mm. calling her your big sister and... I was. Well, what was that about? Claire, in fact, in tonight's Daily Show said, what is that about? What's the, t the turnaround in two days that so suddenly Camilla was your friend? Oh, really? I thought she was my friend the whole time. <laughs> um, uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I was, and then I seen that, I was like, oh, oh my God. <laughs> and um, oh, but that's how the game is as well, because you have to be harsh, because Big Brother hounds you, drills you. And you're just like, oh, oh, oh. And, yeah, but it's serious, you know. I mean, there are mm. people in the house, particularly at this end of the game, you know, they're going to be evicted. It's the end of their Big Brother journey. You don't do it lightly. Mm. I mean, yours were sincere, weren't they? What do you mean? When, when you were nominating, you weren't just making them up. Oh, I had to. I, love, I had to put more of an, like, not an act, because more emphasis. I had, yeah, more emphasis onto it because he. Oh, he hates me in there, I swear. <laughs> he gave, he's given me points a couple of times. Strikes. Oh, oh no, point, nomination points. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at how the tally board's going now. Oh, let's have a look. There we are. Jamie. Uh, oh, he could be... This could be interesting. Jamie's on six. Rob's on six. Are you going to vote if he's nominated? That'd be interesting. I don't Camilla know four. Galen two. <laughs> Ashley one. Claire one. Let's turn the page. And John with oh, John. one. Okay, so we've got three people in the lead there, and just two more housemates to pump up the nomination soccer ball. Katie faces the ten Big Brother questions, and John slips off his tracksuit and gives us a glimpse of his three-point twist. <laughs> well. Before I go, I'm going to come up with some new grips. The ball's new. So difficult. Yeah, so efficient. I hurt you, Angel. Like that. Because that's how you play, play tennis. Table tennis. <laughs> the shoulder strip. This is the, uh... What? I think the European is clearly the worst. <laughs> My favourite... Continental. Mm. You and Continental? Just pull it.
Can you shoot one of the goats out through the machine? Matt! Welcome back to Live Nomination, where last night's a big day. Katie is giving us up-to-the-minute insights into the minds of this year's housemates. We've got the 10 Big Brother questions coming up, okay. but we've got to do our, vi our final two nominations, OK? So, let's start with a man who has no problem expressing his feelings on any matter in the universe, the man with a mega mullet, Rob. Yes. Now, last week, Rob <laughs> nominated Jamie, your Jamie, because he breaks things, and John, because he gets fined for singing commercial tunes. Oh, we mentioned that. So, let's see who Rob flicks his quiff at this week. Jamie, there you Rob. Big brother. Who do you nominate for two points for eviction and why? This week, two, two points for eviction goes to Jamie. We had a meeting on Wednesday night regarding a few issues and, and general cleanliness and he had a quote, rat's ass approach or attitude towards it. And besides that, he's lost a further $25,000 in the last two weeks, which is absolutely pitiful. This is the third time you've nominated him. It's an ongoing problem, Big Brother, and I would just think, well, we've just got a different mentality about different things and it's clashing at the moment. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction and why? One point for eviction tonight, believe it or not, goes to John. John's been here for eight weeks, continues to push the boundaries and rules and regulations put into place um, and getting fined for it as well. If you're here for eight weeks, by all means, someone, you should have your head together and actually understand what the rules and regulations are by now. Have you explained that to him? <laughs> I'm not his mum and I'm not his dad. I'm not, I'm not going not, not gonna to have to explain myself. He's, it's self-explanatory. Follow the rules and there's no problems. That is all. What? Sorry. <laughs> I, uh, Katie was just telling me, yeah, we're breaking the rules. He's a bit of a stickler for rules, isn't he? Oh, why would you be? <laughs> I know, because he's very serious. He's very serious. Oh. Do you think Rob actually wants to win? I don't know. I... I don't know if I thought of it like that. I just think he wants to get on Big Brother's good side. Yeah, he does He's... seem like a... a... <laughs> Whatever that means. OK, now we've got one more housemate to have his say in the diary room. It is not looking good for Rob, Jamie and Camilla. But, of course, all that could change with the all-important three-point twist. So let's cross now to the diary room and see who Ashley dings with his nomination donk. And remember, last week he copped a point from Big Brother for not nominating correctly. That's a mechanical term, thank you, for cars. This could be tense, but knowing Ashley, it probably won't be that tense. OK, let's cross. <laughs> Ashley, who do you nominate for two points for eviction and why? For two points, I nominate Rob. This is for strategic reasons. I think um, Rob is a big threat. The reason for that is uh, the way he conducts himself in the house, in the way that he... Um, talks in the way that he's a bit of a suck up as such and I don't think any other housemates will vote him and there and also the fact that he's got no fines and he really controls himself in the house. When you say he's a threat, a threat to what? A threat to me because I think he'll last longer in the game than me. Does that mean you can win Big Brother? It means that I think he's uh, a big competitor and I think um, he could beat me, yes. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction and why? For one point, I nominate Camilla. The reason for this is uh, Wednesday night discussion. discussion. Uh, she had a glass of wine and she just didn't know when to, you know, be quiet and uh, let it go. And then um, further on during the week, she was uh, doing the dishes. And what do you mean? Oh, we were having a conversation on Wednesday night, as usual. And um, she got a bit carried away and kept on nagging and nagging at the same thing. And it really got to me because it made someone else get hurt. And she just didn't know when to shut up. Actually, you're not explaining your nomination and you're not nominating for others. Get to the point, you're running out of time. And then further on during the week, she um, was doing the dishes and she kept on whining because they weren't her dishes when they obviously were, they were everyone's dishes and it's her duty to do them. And therefore, she's just a big whiner and it, it just got to me. That is all. Oh, that's <laughs> Okay. 